Welcome to Streets of the U.S. Today, I will be in Charlotte, North Carolina, and I will be discussing the Hidden Valley Kings. This is a homegrown gang that operates in the city of Charlotte. This gang has been involved in drug trafficking, multiple murders, and various other crimes. In 2005, five members of the Hidden Valley Kings were involved in a high-profile murder. Hidden Valley gang members had been involved in a rolling shootout with rivals on North Tyrone Street. After the shooting, Juan Lawrence was dead. This gunfight started from an earlier altercation that day at Eastland Mall. Law enforcement said that Lawrence fired a gun at the mall earlier in the afternoon. Police arrested Antonio Pruitt for the shooting. Two members of his own gang testified against him. Pruitt pled guilty to second degree murder. He got 18 to 22 years in prison. After that murder case, several Hidden Valley Kings were arrested and charged for drug trafficking and received 20 to 50 years in prison. In 2013, the Charlotte Police Department conducted an undercover drug operation inside the Hidden Valley neighborhood. They chose to use Hidden Valley Elementary School. During that undercover operation, the police got into a shootout with some of the gang members. One person was killed. A police informant was also shot. The shooting took place on the school grounds, which caused outrage from residents from the neighborhood. Fortunately, no children were in school during this drug operation. The city of Charlotte filed a gang injunction against members of the Hidden Valley Kings. This gang injunction allows police to arrest the Hidden Valley Kings if they hang with each other or try to recruit new members. If you like this story, please like, subscribe, and comment to the channel. Thank you.